Chad. One hot summer day, Melissa the fluffy white, three-year-old cat, was curled up in her favorite corner of her home. A book and music store and a and music store, Melissa lazily listened to the normal store sounds as Diane, one of the owners, helped customers. Suddenly, Melissa heard a stranger's rough voice and Diane un and Diane's unsteady answer. Diane sounded afraid. Melissa quickly padded around the corner. What she saw made her back arch and her stand and her first stand in stand up in anger. A man with a knife had backed up, had backed Diane in a corn into a corner. He was demanding that she open the cash re cash register. Diane told the man to do it himself. She didn't want to get any closer to him or that sharp knife. Melissa sprang into action, her long white fur standing on end, claws out, and tail standing up straight, standing straight up. She jumped onto the, onto the counter and stalked toward the man, snarling with every step. He shouted at her to go back, but she kept on. He waved the knife at her. But her eyes just narrowed. Her growl deepened, and she kept on. Melissa growled louder, continuing to move. Closer, her eyes locked on him. The man looked around for something to protect himself with. He threw a chair at Melissa, but she ducked and kept coming. Because of the distraction, Diane was able to slip, away, slip out the store and call for help. The man was so afraid, he ran out the store, too without uh, even emptying the cash register. Melissa's bravery had saved the day and possibly Diane's life. It doesn't matter how big you are. Melissa was really sm was a was really small was really a rather small cat. God can use you to be a hero for him. The scripture reading for today is The Lord is my helper. I will not be afraid. What can man do to me? Hebrews 13 verse 6.